Liberal protesters in Wisconsin did not start off by stalking and assaulting lawmakers as they did last week. It really started, um, the infancy was back in February when uh, we really had the protests going on big time, the siege of the Capitol. And the, unfortunately, the Capitol Police, uh, led by Chief Tubbs, did not want confrontation, really did not want arrest and wanted everybody just to sing kumbaya and be at peace. And the last thing I want to do tonight for anyone is to go hands on or make any type of arrest or threats of arrest. Representative Steve Noss says the reluctance to get tough on crime has led to a dangerous environment and that is unexcusable. My personal opinion is that right now Chief Tubbs should be removed as uh, chief in this building and placed somewhere else. Uh, DOA should take a a close look at his actions and do an investigation, an oversight investigation, historically from last February to now as to why did you not do certain things you could have to calm the situation and to bring control to the building. And depending on the outcome of that, he would stay on or if need be, you'd, you'd fire him for not doing his job. It's dereliction to duty right now. Protesters have grown accustomed to law enforcement's gentle treatment. When they come, just go, really. You made, you made a point. Please don't resist. Protesters now regard any law enforcement action whatsoever as crossing the line. Last week in the Capitol, some protesters were removed from the assembly for breaking the rules of the gallery. They did not go quietly. This protester, C.J. Terrell, described the scene to the media the next day. They got a couple of us. They uh, picked me up by my handcuffs, got my wrist. Uh, two of my friends have neck injuries, um, and one of my friends has a back injury, and it's all because people were holding cameras. What and about stalking and assaulting people? S assaulting? Are you kidding me? People are getting hit by police officers and pouring a beer is assault? Get out of here. They're pouring me They're by my handcuffs. Stand up, please. So now they are getting aggressive towards police officers because they know the higher ups are saying don't arrest them or if you do just give them a slap on the wrist. And now that you know that you're in free will to do whatever you want because very little if anything is going to happen to you. So it's made it very dangerous for the police officers also. Back to March, when Capitol Police Chief Tubbs took a megaphone and pleaded with the protesters to leave the building, the protesters let him know who was calling the shots. Chief Tubbs, you've been fabulous. You've been really amazing. We There was no consensus to give him the mic. For the McIver Institute, I'm Bill Osmolsky.